Gooder Nation, I kind of want to talk about the wide receiver room. And not the Devontae, the Hunter Renfro, and, and the Wallers. We all know that that's established probably one of the best trios in all of football. Let's just let's just be honest. I want to kind of talk about Tyron Johnson, Keelan Cole, Demarcus Robinson, Mac Collins, all those guys because they're in a really unique situation. But before we get into that, if you guys haven't already, subscribe to the channel and hit it with a like button. We got some content coming out with some other content creators that you guys are all well aware of. And I think that it's going to be stuff that you guys really don't want to miss. So hit the bell notification icon and smash the like button on this video. So let's jump straight over to that wide receiver room. And look, this is a room that's really unique this season. And I'll tell you why. All these guys are on one-year deals. And we've seen in times past that Derek Carr has given opportunities to guys like Zay Jones and Nelson Aguilar. You go back even farther, Seth Roberts and, and really gave Michael Crabtree a kind of resurrection to his career at that wide receiver position. This is a guy who really creates opportunities for wide receivers. And with all of these guys on one-year deals, all you need is one of the four to emerge in this offense. And, and, and something that's going to be to their benefit is that we all know the coverages that these defenses are going to have to allocate to Devontae and Hunter and Waller. That these guys are really going to be going against CB4s and CB5s. And that's to say that these, these teams that we're playing, that their defenses are healthy. Let's say their secondary gets beat up a little bit and you got teams signing guys from the practice squads and you're going to have guys that try to cover Tyron Johnson with 4-3-2 speed deep or, or, or a guy like Keelan Cole lining up on the outside going against a practice squad player. Look, these are guys that are going to find success against defenses because the lack of attention that's going to be thrown their way. So all these guys in this room know that. Look, if, I, if I'm one of those guys... I'm eating up this playbook and I'm coming to this team to work because you have a quarterback in place that's really going to give you an opportunity to go earn a really good solid contract. I mean, go look at what he's done with recent players like Nelson Aguilar, who goes and signs a big deal with New England. You go look at a Zay Jones, who signs a big year, a big deal with the Jacksonville Jaguars, earning $10 million a year. And it looks Zay didn't put out outstanding numbers. I mean, he, he really fit a need at the time, but he didn't really blow you away. So guys like Keelan Cole and look, Zay Jones and Nelson Aguilar, they were going against CB1, CB2s, uh, top nickel guys. Like, look, they had to go against the tough competition. These guys like Keelan Cole, Demarcus Robinson and Tyron Johnson and Matt Collins, these guys are going to be going against the guys that are a little bit lower on these rosters. So look, I'm really interested in seeing who is, who is it going to be, right? Who's going to emerge? Who's going to show up and put in the work? Whoever it is. I'm supporting it. I'm all in. I can't wait to see it because I think it's going to be special. My personal opinion, it's probably going to be a Tyron Johnson or a Keelan Cole. That's just my take. Uh, so Raider Nation, let me know who your guy is down in the comment section below. Who is your guy that you think could really emerge in this wide receiver room? Uh, I love chatting it up with you guys. So like I said, if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, you can do that right here. And I encourage you to check out these two recently uploaded videos. I think that you would really like them. And look, everybody here in the sound of my voice, man, may the Lord Jesus Christ bless each and every single one of you. And until next time, Raider Nation, just win, baby.